All right, going to show examples of subliminal explicit images in kids films, Disney films for kids, quote unquote. And I'm not going to get too graphic. I'm just going to show the image and just leave it at that. I'm not going to describe anything because it's it's pretty perverted. Uh, you're, you, if you're if you're an adult, if you know anything, you're going to understand what they're trying to picture here. Because when you're a kid, you don't notice it. It goes into your subconscious. But the Illuminati, how they do is how they the Luciferian Illuminati, Jesuit ran Illuminati, how they do it is they flash it very subliminally, so it goes into your subconscious. So you don't pick it up at first, but your subconscious sees it which I've talked about in that in other videos. But here are the images. So here's a picture of a scene from The Lion King where the main character just plops down and some dust goes into the air and it spells, you know, the word sex, basically. It spells sex, S-E-X. That's what the dust in the air spells. And it's very subliminal, but when you look at it very closely, that's what it spells. Right there for everyone to see. It's right in your face, but you don't notice it, but your subconscious does. Here's the next image of the a poster for the Lion King, and I'm not even going to describe what that even picture is. You can see right there in the image what it pictures, um, very subliminally, right in your face, but you don't see it. But again, your subconscious does, and this is on a kid's poster as well. Again, not going to get too gra graphic because you know I don't need to vex you guys, but this is the kind of stuff that Disney slips into their kids' films. Here's a picture of the Little Mermaid, uh, a poster of the Little Mermaid, and look at the castle. Look at the image on the castle. It's a phallic symbol. That's all I'm going to say about it. I'm not going to get too graphic. It's a phallic symbol, right there, for your subconscious to see. Here's another picture. You think, oh, it's just one picture. Well, here's another picture of that same poster, uh, zoomed out, and there is that same phallic symbol, right on the castle, right there, that golden palace they have right there right there in the background, hidden in plain sight. Here's another picture from the same movie, The Little Mermaid, where the they're getting married and the priest is actually having an erection, okay? I'll just put it that way. He's having an erection right on the screen right there. I'm not gonna get too more graphic than that, but you don't notice it, but it's right there hidden in plain sight, like I said before. You see, that's what the Illuminati does. They hide things in plain sight for you. Here is uh, Mickey Mouse. A picture of Mickey Mouse holding his, uh, I guess his girlfriend, the other, uh, I guess her name is Minnie Mouse, I forget, I forget what her name is, I, I can't, it's been a long time since I've seen these things, seen these cartoons, but you zoom up close and you know what it's picturing, okay, not going to say anything more than that, you just know what it's picturing if you are an adult, basically. Uh, pretty, pretty perverted, they slip this in kids' cartoons, and here's a picture all the way back from the 1940s. You got Bambi. This is a movie from the 1940s, and I'm not even going to say what that pictures. You you already know what that pictures pretty much. If you're a grown person, you've been through school, you know, public school. Unfortunately, as a, as a kid, you know what that pictures. I'm not going to say anything more than that. I'm going to leave it at that. But those are just some examples of the really perverted, subliminal, explicit images in Illuminati Disney films. And that's what the Illuminati does. They hide things in plain sight. The Illuminati will hide things in plain sight for your subconscious to see. And it flashes like for a split second so you don't notice it. But your subconscious picks it up. And you wonder why these images flash in your mind. That's what the Illuminati does. And, he, and it's just a few examples. This, these Disney films are just full of all this, all this perverted, subliminal... Uh, explicit content. It's all over the place. These are just a few examples. These are very mild examples, by the way, that I could just pick out. Most of the other examples are really way too perverted for me to even show on video. So, anyway, don't be deceived by the Illuminati propaganda from Disney. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.